Welcome back, everybody. You already know this your girl, Heaven Sent. I want to thank all my subscribers. I truly appreciate y'all. Okay, so this is going to be a timeless blackout. All right. Keep in mind, you may have already went through this situation. Okay, you could be going through this situation right now, or this situation is coming for your motherfucking ass. Keep in mind, this read is general. And it may not resonate with no damn body. You see what I'm saying? No. Let me tap right the fuck in. Because the energies that I'm looking at for this timeless blackout, okay? I'm seeing a change of heart. Like a shift in a way a person is feeling about a motherfucker. Okay, um, I'm seeing here somebody could be dealing with someone that's already in some type of situation. Okay, now dealing with the situation, okay, that somebody is in and somebody may have got caught up in some shit. Maybe kind of hard to let go of motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? But this situation, I feel like that somebody is in okay aside from you somebody is connected to someone okay this is definitely some type of commitment families coming together motherfuckers know each other type shit okay could have been around for a long time years or whatever okay this type of situation okay commitment marriage whatever the fuck you want to call it it's kind of fake you know it's like want to be seen a certain way like this marriage or situation is failing okay and this situation is is like okay don't want nobody to gossip about it don't want nobody to talk about it want it to be seen as picture perfect and but it's not it's not picture perfect at all this is what they want everybody to see it is okay especially when friends or family members come over they put on this act of like the perfect couple or everything is good it's no issue it's no problems but when motherfuckers leave it's just it gets silent it gets silent because i i feel like somebody could be aware it's another person okay that other person could be you somebody could be aware of that or it's like a fear here or think about it a lot somebody could be just in this situation due to children okay could be using children as an excuse to stay in this type of shit okay because i feel like whoever this person is is definitely stepping the fuck out okay they stepping out because in this situation in this commitment this person is very lonely this person is very lonely it's a feeling here like okay when you stop fucking with this person or you just don't want to talk to this person or you just don't want to deal with this person it's like okay you know what i'm not dealing with you go back to wherever the fuck you was at like i'm focusing on some other shit like may just cut this person off this person may get depressed because now they got to go back to a situation where it's like, okay, I already depressed and miserable. It's like, okay, now my heart is broke on top of being depressed and miserable. So this person may charge at you, okay, when you do, you know, decide to back, get back fucking with them. They charge your head at you, okay? You two may meet up, have sex, or whatever the case may be. This person may go back home and have a peace of mind okay it's something with peace and get to sleep and, and it's like 
this person leaves but lies you know they leave the home situation and lie and, and manipulate and play mind games okay because this person is is feeling unwanted it's a feeling here of unwanted the person that they married or in some type of relationship with don't see them don't show them no affection don't show them no type of love don't do shit pretty much and this is a front in front of family members and friends it's a fear here of this marriage failing and everybody talking about it because i feel like somebody is already talking about some shit it's already little chit chats and little sad conversations between friends and family members okay somebody may already saw something somebody may already peep something somebody may already already said something and slipped the fuck up okay it's definitely some chit chat around somebody leaving somebody knows something here this could be cousins this could be friends or this could be actually family that may know somebody is not happy they may sense somebody is not happy they not getting the attention or something like that somebody seeing somebody is not emotionally happy somebody see it and they talking about it somebody definitely feel lonely i feel like whatever the situation is 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 it been ruined you know like it been ruined the damage has been done dealing with it, it is betrayal on top of betrayal on top of betrayal it is just the way maybe this person was conditioned or grew up or something with tradition type shit maybe they never seen a failed marriage so it's like okay let me just we're just gonna st- stick through it through thick and thin type shit you know what i'm saying to death do us part like some bullshit because ain't no way you supposed to be settling i don't give a fuck how many kids you got with a motherfucker like if the marriage ain't working the situation ain't working it ain't working if it ain't it it ain't it why try to force something i feel like now with you here okay outside this relationship this person is a whole nother person with you this person do not act the same with you versus how they are in this commitment because this person is kind of depressed in the commitment so it's kind of like predictable in this situation that they got going on it's predictable like whatever they do is predictable like it's pretty much boring okay now with you it's a whole another situation okay you may just bring out another side this person may talk a lot talk too much they like you may be like okay shut the fuck up you know what i'm saying like this person may just tell you a lot of things i feel like this person may feel in control or something like that you may put this person in their masculine energy they may feel very masculine you know what i'm saying around you like because you always in this feminine energy around this person So you give them that that energy that they need that they love to be in it's something with like power control like something it's like this person is is offering you trying to offer you is about to offer you what you pretty much is like missing because you got everything you may just be missing one thing and that may be a commitment 
like you got everything else everything you could possibly want you got it but you may just don't have that commitment you know what i'm saying like you may have friends with benefits or whatever the case may be but you don't have that commitment that solid commitment that solid offer i feel like this person is about to offer you this commitment because whatever the situation that they in it's about to be a failed marriage and everybody gonna have to accept it <laughs> like it's like that type of shit because it's not fucking working it's not working this person is definitely gonna come to you and tell you the truth about this commitment this this marriage that they was in this situation they about to tell you the truth about it because i feel like you could have been asking questions about it like okay what's going on and why are you stepping out of it <laughs> you know what i'm saying that's that's what motherfuckers be really want to know like why is you stepping out on you know what i'm saying a certain motherfucker like what's going on you know what i'm saying what's really going on i feel like somebody is definitely gonna get they heart broke somebody has to change your heart they not feeling wanted this offer this commitment this proposal will definitely break this it's gonna break a heart may break several hearts okay but just this could have been something that you was waiting on and you may knew this was coming but you just didn't know when because i feel like this person may have gave the situation a chance they may have tried to fight for it tried to work it out multiple times maybe gave a motherfucker clues and shit on what they need to do or what it's like something where this person tried to fight for it but still did get nothing in return it, it still was a feeling here of unwanted it's like okay why would i still stay in a situation with a person that don't want me but i know somebody else do like it's no love but I do know somebody who loved me. It's like, why not be with that person who loved me instead of staying in a situation with a person who don't love me? It's like, okay, how does that shit work? So, yeah, this person definitely tried multiple times. It ain't like this person gave up. It, it was like, kept trying, kept trying, kept trying. Still felt the same. It's like, yeah, have you learned your lesson? <laughs> okay, it's like a lesson that should have been learned. If this ain't this ain't where it's at. This has ran its course. It's like you're not happy because this is not the person you're supposed to be with. So stop trying to force this shit. Before the person who you're supposed to be with disappear on your motherfucking ass. And you really stuck in this situation for good. It's like that. So this person is definitely, I see, finna leave. They finna leave. They coming towards you. They coming towards you. It's like, why wouldn't they come towards you? <laughs> it's like, okay, I'm finna leave this burden. This, cause this is a burden. This is too much to try to keep up some type of image. That's fake. It's like pretending to be happy in a situation that you miserable, miserable in. It's like, why pretend? You can have a real deal. You can really show motherfuckers that you happy. Like, you know what I'm saying? You ain't got to pretend. So I feel like, yeah, this person is coming towards you, offering you the real deal because whatever they in is, is fake as hell. It's not the real deal. And I feel like this person has a lot of love for you. And you two just go well together. It's a complimentary energy here and it's magical. You know what I'm saying? You can make a lot of shit happen when you two come together so yeah this is definitely a change of heart around this bitch a major shift okay you may wasn't expecting it but it's time it's time for for you two to come together it's time for this person to leave a situation that they would been miserable in but was put on the front due to some type of tradition. Well, it's like, okay, somebody's gonna break the curse around this bitch because this was definitely a curse, okay? Settling for some shit. Don't want to be seen as, oh, this is a bad marriage. It's just, yeah, it's failed. 
failure okay it's like yeah this is not the one and i'm not and i'm not gonna pretend to it for it to be the one it's like no i found the real one because this ain't where it's at you know what i'm saying so it's like look i'm sorry pops mama kids brothers sisters whatever but <laughs> i gotta leave this you know what i'm saying I, i'm going to a true love around this bitch so y'all gonna have to get with the motherfucker program so yeah thumbs the fuck up okay if that shit just made sense and i'll see you on the next one peace out y'all